Welcome to part three. Um, I'm going to make a new layer here and we're going to make the eyebrows. In the eyebrows, what we're going to be doing is using the top part of the eyebrow is forming the shape of the eyebrow and then we're going to build the eyebrow up from the bottom to the top so that it becomes fuller from the bottom. Make sure you have the correct shape at the top and that will form part of the shape of the face when, we, when I come to turn the background off. You'll see that in a moment. Just build it up. Don't worry about neatness too much at the moment. And then as I zoom in, this square end, we're going to use the paintbrush here and we're just going to round it off. Because otherwise it looks slightly unnatural to have this squared end. And I'm just clicking here, individual clicks. And what I'm going to do now, in a moment, is we need to copy this and flip it onto the other side of the face for the second eyebrow. I'm going to do this with the select tool and select around it, forming a rectangle. And then next to the select tool is a blue arrow. So click on the blue arrow and this will allow us to edit it. Go to copy, click copy and it will put another copy on top, directly on top. This will allow you to pick it up and move it out of the way. In the centre of that rectangle, you can grab the circle to manipulate the shape and then put it onto the best fit for the eyebrow. Once you've done this, you'll probably need to patch up the underside of the second eyebrow, depending on, on how symmetrical your face is, and then build up again on the underneath just with the line tool like we did a moment ago. Just build it up from the bottom up. And that should mean we'll have pretty much all the parts of the face apart from the ears and some colour. We're going to do the colour in a moment. So now when you're happy with it, we can go and turn off the background and you should have a semi-complete face. I'm going to turn off the background. And there's the, the base of your cartoon face. What I'm going to do now is the eyebrows the nose and mouth and the hair and face layers, we're going to compress them down. So we're going to move them, we're going to put them all on top of each other with the merge tool. You can just see what I'm clicking on now. Merge and merge and merge until all I'm left with is two layers. 